when we were first developing Mathematica, uh, we, we kind of wondered how long it would take before the things we built would be uh, uh, absorbed into education. Because we kind of had this idea that maybe, um, maybe it'd be useful for educational purposes. But uh, uh, people told us, oh, things move really slowly in education. It's, uh, uh, it'll be decades before anybody does anything with, with Mathematica and education. But they didn't count on Jerry Yule. He kind of immediately realized that there was something pretty exciting that could be done for education with Mathematica. It's sort of been interesting to watch even over the past 20 years, the extent to which the things that, that Jerry was saying uh, 20 years ago about how calculus teaching could be, could be revolutionized with the tools that, that we now have, um, how that has uh, become uh, sort of central to, to even the mainstream of what's being done in these areas. Way back when we first started developing Mathematica, I'd really hoped that people would end up using it in teaching and education. But what I mainly hoped was that they would not use it for creating yet more really bad educational software, of which there's plenty in the world. Uh, and in fact, part of the process that, that I went through in trying to figure out how the notebook interface should work was trying to make it difficult to create that sort of bad software and maybe make it a little bit easier to create good software, good teaching software. So it was really wonderful when Jerry showed up kind of out of the blue and as if by magic, understood exactly how I thought it should be done. Um, and then not only understood that, but actually went and created an entire calculus course and put hundreds of students through it and really sort of showed what the potential was for using Mathematica and education the right way. He has written some phenomenal courseware using Mathematica. And um, what it allows the students to do is guided active discovery and learn on, on their own. He's totally reformed calculus. And um, I don't know that the rest of the world's really seen that yet. But he knows what it's all about, and, and he knows how to make the right kind of use of the technology. If you have the right tools to look beyond the uh, scare forefront, you can learn a lot more. You just have to have you just have to take the first step. And Jerry has been very smart uh, in in uh, getting people to notice that beautiful fact about mathematics. He loves having students discover mathematics, which is the way I think mathematics should be taught. Because when you discover it, then you own it. And so um, I admire him greatly for how he's changed the way that so many students have learned mathematics. A lot of teachers really look at your test results or the answer to a particular question. And Jerry did much more than that. He looked at really the way in which you solved a problem, the way in which you worked, and the way you uh, put, the, put the solution together. He was thinking about the way that you thought and, and the way that you could best learn. I think he's just an excellent example of a true educator, in meaning uh, teaching people how to think about math, how to think about their lives, how to encourage others, and so he's been, a, what you'd say, an excellent example in a lot of ways. I've uh, really learned most of what I know about teaching from Jerry. Uh, he's been a, a good friend. We wrote a book together, uh, which was a, a hoot. It, it was, uh, it's a lot of fun working with him. He really is, uh, has always been an inspiration to me as far as really understanding what is important in mathematics. He was more or less like a father figure to me. He didn't realize it, but he actually encouraged me, made me feel like I could accomplish things. And I stayed in grad school largely because of Jerry Ewell. He just, he just lights up the room. He's like the center of attention. And he doesn't mean to be, um, but you know that's just the kind of personality he has. His influence isn't simply from having him a student or working with him mathematically. It's having, having, having connections with him personally. The person is, is, is unique and spectacular. He, he just is someone that encompasses everything that is good about learning and math and he, he's just such a great person to know. He has still always been our bedrock. He's been the founder. He's been the one who's helped us set the course for the future. So hopefully I'll be able to carry that forward. Uh, we have uh, Jerry Yule and his colleagues to, to thank for um, for the kind of uh, a great innovation in uh, the communication of calculus. Certainly, I'm pleased to have been able to provide a tool that's made possible the kinds of innovations that, that uh, uh, Jerry has, um, 
uh, has pushed for, for all these years. I know there are many success stories of people whose uh, uh, educational experience um, centrally involved calculus and mathematica.